Good morning. Welcome to another edition of Slow Money's Real Street Kids Talk Show with your host, Seven. And, uh, you know, there's a way we planned it, and then there's a way that, you know what I'm saying, it actually happens. You know, uh, we all on a journey in life, and uh, some of us straight a path and, you know, endeavor to get back on it, you know what I'm saying, in due time. And uh, some of us just stay the course. Either way it goes, man, the way we planned it is not always the way that it will actually happen. And we have to be in accordance to understand that, you know what I'm saying, there's things that we may want and, uh, to have out of life, you know. I endeavor myself to be a mogul and a tycoon. You understand what I'm saying? And I, what I've noticed on my journey is the way I planned it is not actually how it happens. You understand what I'm saying? Because we have to gain education and understanding of what it means to be that. In my situation, I have to understand what it means to be a mogul and a tycoon. I have to understand that just because the paper's right, you know what I'm saying? Just because the paperwork's right, just because the business is legit, doesn't always mean that you going to get your uh, employee. Doesn't always mean you going to get your style. Doesn't always mean that you going to get that proper business relationship. Doesn't always mean you going to get that building. Doesn't always mean that your business is going to go the way you seen it going in the first few weeks or so. You have to build that rapport. You understand what I'm saying? People going to flake on you. People going to say that this is what they want to do and be in life. But it doesn't always happen that way. They might have things going on in their life. You understand? They may not be confident and feel that they can attack the dream. You understand what I'm saying? To turn it into a goal and a vision and eventually bring it to reality and to the forefront of life. You understand what I'm saying? Some of us in these times of need, you know what I'm saying, in these times of trials and tribulations, want to be activists. But that doesn't mean that they have the confidence to project their voice and become a leader. You understand what I'm saying? We want things, but we have to be in accordance of understanding that, you know what I'm saying, we on this path, it doesn't, you don't jump out onto the basketball court day one and be Kobe. You know what I'm saying? Kobe had to work for that. Kobe was in the gym when nobody else wanted to be in the gym. As Gilbert Arenas once said at best, you know what I'm saying, in order to be the best, in order to be great, there was days that I didn't want to get up and practice. But I understood that I had to, that it was a need for me to. Because I was on a mission to be something. I was on a mission to leave my legacy on that basketball court. And of course, I'm paraphrasing. Shane Battier said, you know what I'm saying? He said it best. I knew it was time for me to hang up my sneakers when I no longer love to practice. And we have to understand that practicing is our game. Practicing is the spotlight. Practicing is where the fans love us. You understand what I'm saying? Because without practice, without uh, prior planning to prevent piss poor performance, there is no game. You understand what I'm saying? There is no 30 points. There is no Hall of Fame. There is no name in the rafters. We have to understand that it starts right now. It starts in that basement. It starts in that garage. It starts in the shop. You understand what I'm saying? It starts in that mirror. Get your mirror talk on. Build your confidence. Get ready. Get right and get proper. You understand what I'm saying, man? You can have any lady you want. You can have any business you want. You can have any man you endeavor to have. You understand what I'm saying? You can have anything in this world because it's possible. And especially in America, anything's possible. You just got to be willing to pay to play, man. And it's money right here, man. And I'm telling you, man, it's, it's money easy to get. It's just harder to maintain it. It's harder to make that money elevate. It's harder to understand that you have to elevate and be in a proper relationship with your dollar bill. You understand? You and your dollar bill got to be on a first-to-first -first name basis. You got to understand, man, just like you get up and get out here and get it in the morning, your dollar bill going to say, hey, Dre, hey, such and such, hey, boop the scoop. 
I got to get out here and get it today. Uh, uh, are you going to tell me where I need to be at? Or do I need to find out where I need to be at? Because I need to be around the money. I need to be around the people who know how to make this money work. You understand? So that I can grow. So that I can elevate from a dollar bill to a five, to a ten, to a hundred, to a hundred thousand, to a million. From a million to a billion, to a trillion. You understand what I'm saying? Because I'm trying to be global. I'm trying, I'm trying to touch international money. I'm American money, but I'm trying to touch Europe money. You understand me? And if you ain't the proper man or woman for the job, the money going to leave you and they ain't coming back. You understand what I'm saying? The dollar bill that won't stay a dollar bill going to stay a dollar bill around your local market. But it might not stay in your pocket for too long. Because at the end of the month, at the end of the week, you want to all the money gone because they don't want to associate with you. Man, getting the proper quarters in a relationship with your dollar bill, man. The way we planned it is not actually how it's going to go, man. But it's just God showing you who you are. You understand, man? When you listening to that music video and you like, man, that, that, that man's it. That woman's it. Hey, I'm feeling that. I, I won't be like that. God putting you on that path right now. Be aware of what you spew out into the world, man. Endeavor to get it. Endeavor to touch somebody. Network, communicate, man. Be effective and execute. If it's anything you ever feel I miss, if you feel like I ain't doing my job and leading the culture in the right direction, because I'm putting that on my back, please feel free to comment. Let us know how you personally feel. You know what I'm saying? Let us, let us know how, how, you, how you don't feel. You understand what I'm saying? Because your voice needs to be heard at the end of the day, man. And I'm telling you right man, right now, this is the platform for you to look back on and you like, man, I gave my voice today. And then years from later, man, you like, man, I, I'm a mega star. But it started with somebody telling me my voice was important. And then I had to understand that and act on it. Your voice is important. Let us know how you feel. Let us know what you think, man. Breed and, and, and give and reciprocate uncommon information. We on uh, YouTube, Plugged In Incorporated Media, LLC. We on uh, uh, Instagram, at Plugged In 37, as well as Tycoon, P-I-T-M. That's T-Y-C-O-O-N-P-R-T-M, or we are small businesses, big businesses. You know what I'm saying? Just anybody willing and wanting and needing to shine and be a shiner in they spotlight. You know what I'm saying? Endeavoring to get it. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Maintain their image and, uh, for the business, community, and relationships that it is that they serve. We on Snapchat, Plugged In 37, Tumblr, Plugged In 37, Plugged In Incorporated Media, LLC. And we on Twitter, at Carter Keys Magazine, that's an uppercase Q. We have Facebook, Drake Carter, D-R-A-Y-C-A-R-T-E-R. And we have a Facebook group, Club Interview, where we are right now continuing to build. And I'm telling you, man, it's going to be the thing that you're going to want to be a part of, that you're going to need to be a part of, because it's going to help you network, maintain, mix, mingle, and jingle. And you might find you something proper in there, because we always doing the dap and keeping the pee. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? So you always got to do what it got to do, man, and stay laid and slayed. You understand that? Yeah, you know. Thank you for all the ones who support and continue to support. You all have a blessed day and a wonderful afternoon and night.